שנה טובה. שנה טובה, אימא. Why didn't you just come in? You know you can just come in. How was your journey? You look tired. Are you hungry? Yes. Let's sit and eat. Okay. Come on. Blessed are you, Lord our God, King of the universe, who has kept us alive and sustained us and brought us to this holiday season. Tell me about how your students are doing. Each one of them. I want to know what to pray for. Oh, Ima, I, I, I don't know that I'll have time to tell you about every single one of them. I, I'm ready to collapse. Fine. Just tell me about your five favorites. Ima, I don't have favorites. You know that. Of course you do. Admit uh, it. Why don't you tell me your favorites? The them? women. Yeah, that didn't take long. Mm. So, are you ready for tomorrow? So many people have told me they can't wait to see you. I'm going to need the box while I'm here. Do you know where it is? Now. Are you sure this is your last time here before? I believe my time is coming. I don't know that I'm ready. I know how you feel. But you also know that I must do the will of you. Will you who loves me. Does it have to be so soon? Are you sure? If not now. Hmm. I miss your father the most during celebrations. Me too. He had so much fun. <laughs> Tomorrow is going to be a fun day. Yes. Yes, it is. The box is near your bed. You'll see it. Thank you. Blessed are you, Lord our God, King of the universe, who kept us alive and sustained us for another year. In your mercy, bestow on us a prosperous year, a bountiful harvest, and the promised arrival of Mashiach, your anointed one, the Son 
of David. Amen. Amen. And now for the reading and interpretation, we have with us Jesus bar Joseph. A reading from the scroll of the prophet Isaiah. The spirit of the Lord God is upon me because the Lord has anointed me to bring good news to the poor. He has sent me to heal the brokenhearted, proclaim liberty to the captives and recovery of sight to the blind, to the opening of the prison for those who are bound, to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. The fulfillment of this scripture, as you have heard it, is today. We are with you. Keep going. Not bad for a carpenter's son, yes? <laughs> I mean, especially Joseph. May he rest in peace. The day of vengeance is in the future. I'm not here for vengeance. I'm here for salvation. You're here for salvation. What are you saying? You know what I'm saying. And this year of Jubilee, this year of the Lord's favor, is not about release from financial debts. I'm here to provide release from spiritual debt. We're the chosen seed of Abraham. We don't have spiritual debt. But this brings up an important truth. No prophet is acceptable in his hometown. You may be the chosen seed of Abraham. You may be the people of the covenants, but that will not bring you my salvation. If you do not realize that you need a year of the Lord's favor, then I cannot save you. Who do you think you are? He's saying we are not the Holy Ones chosen. No, he did not say that. In words, a book of Moses. But the prophet who presumes to speak a word in my name that I have not commanded him to speak, that same prophet shall die. Jesus, if you do not renounce your words, we will have no choice but to follow the law of Moses. I am the law of Moses. Oh, Stand by all that you said. I think I was pretty clear. Your father, may he rest in peace, was a righteous man. Your mother is a good woman. We take no pleasure in the shame you are bringing to their name, nor the grief this will bring upon Mary. But as from the law of Moses, whose life and words you have spat upon today, your sentence is death. Adam. 
Rabbi Benjamin. This isn't going to happen. Not today. Go to sleep, my son. This manger for your bed. You have a long road before you rest your little head. Can you feel the Does the Father guard your heart for now so you can sleep tonight? Here, quick. Hold this for me, eh? I can help? Yes, come. You need to learn how to do this well, huh? What if I hurt your hands? Oh, you have great talent like your Abba. You will be fine. Go ahead. Oh! 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 <laughs> hey, I'm sorry, huh? Your goofy Abba cannot help it. <laughs> That's very good. Go to sleep, my son Go and chase your dreams This world can wait for one more moment Go and sleep in peace Lord, I ask that he for 
just this moment simply be my child Jesus I'm here Ima They take you. I was so scared. I said I would be fine. It's not that time yet. Thank you. It's got everything. Plus some food. Oh, good. Why come here? Jesus, I have something very special to show you. Huh? Go grab that box over there, in the corner. Listen carefully. Huh? This is a mule's bit and bridle. Now, you have seen them before, but this one is very special. Thousands of years ago, when our people were finally set free from slavery, as they were leaving, one of our ancestors from the great tribe of Judah used this very bit and bridle to lead his mule laden with supplies out of Egypt. Of course, the mule eventually died, and everything was lost to the wilderness. But this was in his hand when he escaped, so he kept it. The men in our family have handed this down to each other for 40 generations as a remembrance of our bondage. But more importantly, Jesus, in remembrance of being led to freedom into the promised land. It's old and it's not beautiful, but my father handed it to me to own as I am handing it to you. We always joked. Who knows? Maybe one of us will need it one day. I do not suppose you will bear a son. So maybe it will end its journey with you. But I cannot leave this earth without passing it on. Thank you, Abba. Hi. Jesus. I know I am not your father in the same way that your friend's fathers are. We've talked about this. You understand? But the privilege and the blessing of stewarding your life here on Earth for the short time that I was granted. It is the greatest honor and gift I could ever ask for. Come here, Moise. I pray that I have done right by you, Jesus. Hmm? I remember. Go to sleep, 
my son and be the bridal for you'll know soon enough Come